it, there's for sure a difference between being in the flow and not when things are not flowing. There, there's a huge difference. Uh, when you're really on it and things are flowing and you're in really good shape, um, because it's not like in, in alpine skiing is not like endurance sport where you try to like peak the form because our season goes for so long and you kind of have to be on it every race so you try to stay on it every race uh, but when when you're in the flow it's like everything is just easy uh, you're working with the forces uh, you're working with the bumps you're finished with the turn and for me it's when i'm finished with the turn it's just like a, i don't know it just lifts you up out of the turn you don't have to really use any force to move your hip forward or or anything like this it just boop it just pops up and then you just go into the next turn uh and i when things are really flowing i think it's um it, it's a really great feeling um, and you try to have this feeling as often as possible um, and like I said when you're really in shape and you're really feeling it it's uh, it's just to try to keep it going for as long as possible for sure yeah so so people might have seen me disappointed angry in the finish area um, People have also seen me happy, uh, and I think I think this is a part of life. I think it's a part of sport. Uh, if you perform to your best, the best of your abilities, you're going to be happy. Uh, but if you don't perform to the standard that that you're not accustomed to doing, I think I think you shouldn't be happy. Um, why well, why should you be happy with? not performing in the way that you know you're capable of um, and yes I'm, I might be harsh on myself I might be at times harsh with the people around me uh, but it's not easy to try to become the best in the world uh, if it were easy everyone would do it and when it's not easy you have to work to get there. Uh, and when you are not doing things right and I'm doing something wrong, I'm disappointed about myself. And sometimes, yes, it shows after a race. Uh, but I think that's a huge part of sports. Uh, how boring wouldn't sports be without emotions? Um, and you see that in all different kinds of sports. Um, but yeah, I... I, I, I get disappointed with myself when when I don't do things how I should do it. Uh, but I've also said, if I do the two best runs of my life and I'm fifth, I, I have to be happy with that because that's I, I then I perform to the best of my abilities and I did the best that I could, and someone was just better. That's that's fine. But if I know that I can do better and I didn't perform, then I can't really be happy or satisfied with that. Um, and I think that's general in life as well, how, how things should be a little bit. Um, I think to just have the equal feeling or the equal emotions about everything, I think that's, um, that must be boring. And I think it's the wrong thing for sure in sports, but also in life. <laughs>